So yo, what's up guys? In today's video, we've got the new Paldian Fates EX tins which come out today, guys. And as you can see, we have the Cherizard EX promo card. We've got the Great Tusk EX and the Iron Tread. So obviously these were in the Japanese set and was not inside the English set because they were promo cards. So the only shiny Cherizard you could have pulled was the SAR one. So this is kind of a great product because obviously everyone wants a shiny Cherizard and you literally just have to buy a tin and you get a guaranteed shiny Cherizard, which is awesome. And then you also got these two if you like those or you need those for your like sets or whatever. Then you have them as well, as well as some packs, which is always a nice fun rip. I can imagine this Cherizard one being very, very desirable. Uh, for sure as well and if you do well, guys want to grab some of these check out famousgirl.com we do have these available on the website as well as guys we do have these available in the youtube stream so grab them while they can i can imagine cherries are one selling really quick but each one of these tins contains four booster packs a promo card and a code card so your standard kind of four pack tin there is also a five pack version coming out as well in the uk and probably you're saying everywhere else wherever i'll sell them so there are going to be two variations of this tin so that's going to be kind of interesting a nice collector factor as well get kind of both variations of the tins uh but yeah let's get into it obviously we're going to start off with the charizard one so let's get into it guys so got a nice full well almost full seal um cover usually you can slide these off but that shouldn't be calm like it covers the edges uh ooh, we've got the cardboard insert so this is a Charizard. I am going to imagine I ripped the card right there. But there we go. There we go. That's probably your best bet, right? So the best way to get them out, let me know. Uh, but boom, just because I want to get one to grade. But yo, they even, uh, yeah, a little bit of white in there, but could be worse. Not the baddest condition, you know, English modern is right now, guys. But yeah, guys, there we go. Shiny Charizard, pretty much guaranteed you just buy a tin and you don't have to try and pack it or anything like that. It wasn't too incredibly expensive, but you know, the previous shiny sets, the Charizard has always been the chase card. Obviously, Hidden Fates, Shining Fates, Shining Legends didn't have any. Uh, but then you can also go to like Shining Charizard from Neo as well. But yeah, it's nice to kind of get like a easy way. We don't have to stress about that one really. Just buy a tin, you got it. So that's what I love about this tin and this product. Uh, but yeah, and then you got four packs in there as well. Did I show you the tin? So that is the tin. So we have the Charizard, obviously. Each tin will have a different lid, and then the rest of the tin should be the same. So you got Charizard that side, Paling Fates, so you got that side uh the great tusk that side and then the iron treads that side so boom that is the tin nice little detailed review now we do it here and yeah guys if you again check out the website finstrail.com we have a, obviously a lot of the pallium fakes got restock of etvs and blisters they've been flying out on our streams and on our store uh, yeah just a fun set especially the pull rates ain't too bad obviously the ser's and goals have been difficult to chase down however overall we've been getting a good pull ratio of shinies and full arts and stuff like that and there we go fortress ex there i mean let's go let's go think about the great toss too much but yo let's go let's go guys four packs here so hopefully we can see kind of the pull rates in the four pack tins always the go-to always my go-to when i open like hidden fates i guess that was the, the product that i really reprinted or the only product i reprinted over time as well as the etb but oh wig oh my god has anyone got a Wigglet and a Wugtria in one pack before? Not obviously my favorite cards, but I'm sure some people like that. It's nice to kind of get the shiny evolution there back to back. What's the odds of that one? Wigglet there, nice little double one. That's what I mean, guys. Pull rates are amazing. Double one there. Wigglet and Wugtrio. Wow. What are the odds of that happening? Uh, but yo, let's go, let's go. Let's see if we can get, guys, hopefully an SAR tonight. Three tins. And if this video gets, let's get, give it a like goal. 200 likes. I'll open a whole case of them, which is six tins, so two of each design. So three more tins, six tins in total, uh, four, six, 24 packs. If you want to see that open, let me know, guys. Uh, but yeah, obviously, we open one of each product on the channel from this new range. And every single set, really, we open like one of each product. So if you like that, make sure to like, subscribe, but nothing in that pack there. Yeah, 200 likes, guys. Help me out here and let's get to 200 likes so I can make an excuse to open them on the channel. Uh, but y'all, let's go, let's go, let's see what the Dene, Scrafty, Generator, Swoobat, Charmander, oh, and then nothing there. So at least got a double whammy there. Unfortunately, Charizard laying us down there on the pools. But so we're going into the Iron Tin now. So as you can see, the lid's different. That's how the tins work. The tin matches the promo. The, the lid matches the promo and the, the bottom of the half of it is the same as the rest of the collection. But boom, let's see another method to take this out. Usually I just go, boom, you know what I mean? Eat more time, it's all right. But obviously you're gonna try and get a PSA 10, then I wouldn't advise just pulling it out like that. The rip, probably best method, or a little bit of scissors to the cardboard up to there. And then boom, get that out, you know what I mean? But boom, let's go, let's go. Iron Treads EX. 
And boom. We'll try the scissors method on the last one. So, because these are full art promos in here. Like, I'm, usually with the other ones, just like regular EXs or something. Like, I'm not, or Vs or GXs. I'm not too bothered. Just yank them out. I've never had a problem, I don't think. But, yeah, those are only with the reprints. Obviously, Hidden Fates OG print didn't have those. Uh, and then, obviously, cardboard uh, inserts were only introduced around 21, 2021, I think. Uh, we've got the Executor Hollow. Boom. All right, next up, chat. Next up, come on. Can we get anything here? Can we get a shiny SAR tonight? No, no, no. Uh, no, Mag Mortar. Yo, I'm not looking good on the pools today. But obviously, it's all, down, it's all random. All down to luck. It's only four packs in a tin. So, yeah, it could be whatever, really. But hopefully, get some good pull rates. Same with any product, really. But, okay, a full art judge at least, saving us a little bit. And then, boom, we've got the last pack here. Peak pack. Let's go. Yo, Pikachu Baby Shiny still need. What do I still need, chat? I need a. Uh, I got the God of War, so I need the Mew and Charizard, SAR wise. Those are like my only two chase cards. And then a couple Baby Shinies. But, whoo, we got a poor me AR. So, again, an AR in each of these tins. But, yeah, two hits there, not the worst. But, yeah, I need those. And then Baby Shiny wise, the main ones are like Entei, uh, Pikachu, Lucario. Those are kind of like my main Baby Shinies I'm chasing down. And then, um, yeah, just the Mew and Charizard SARs, really. And once I got those. Hold on, let me get rid of that. But once I got those, that's kind of like my main chase. I only collect selective cards, so my favorite cards, and those are probably my top tier cards there. I do have an ace return with every single uh, card, all the best cards in the set. So check it out, guys, in the chat uh, down below. Uh, we've got the Great Tusk EX here. Let's see, we've got chat. Oh, this one's already creased. Like, look at that. It looks like someone's, they manually put this in here. I can't imagine they manually put this, you know, but let's go that's actually a good idea fold it so you got a little bit of height and then you know what i mean but yeah i wonder how they put it there's some i want to manually do it. i don't think a robot can do that or machine can uh put these in but a great task promo here so boom and boom let's go chat let's go hopefully some goodies to come and yeah Ugh. all right let's go chat let's go and let's hopefully so if we get SAR here, I'll make it all worth it, hopefully, in this last tin. But yeah, so, ooh, we got a baby shiny. At least we got a shiny, because we didn't get any baby shinies in the last one. But Paldian Taurus here. So, boom. But yeah, SAR would make it all worth it. I think the Charizard's pretty expensive. And the new Mew's playable, right, as well. I don't know where I heard that from, but someone told me it's playable. I think on the Leaf video, actually. I was one of those yesterday. Shout out to Unlisted Leaf. But yeah, the Muse playable, so that's been going for a bit. Oh my god, we're literally... Oh, sorry, didn't manage to dash that one, but just a hollow. But um, yeah, we've got an AR in each one. We didn't get one of each, but we've got an AR in each one of these tins. Obviously, poor weights will vary and always random. Um, just in my circumstances, we've got one in each tin. Uh, but yo, come on. Second to last pack, chat. And... Oh, nothing there, but okay. Esparfra EX. Boom, and then the final one. Oh, really want an SCR, man. Really need an SCR, guys. Come on, let's go, let's go. And yeah, we did pull a Charizard on release weekend. Well, a few of them. We did grade one for one of our free grading winners. Obviously, we grade the best pool uh, on our YouTube stream. It gets free grading if you want to get graded. And yeah, we pulled, graded that one for shout out to uh, Geek Theory uh, by Heat Rotom Hollow. So yeah, overall, not too bad pulls. We've got a couple hits in each, which is standard. Uh, and yeah, obviously you got the main thing you're buying these for is these promo cards, guys. So again, if you do want to grab them, check out famousgrail.com. Uh, and yeah, like I said, chairs are the ones I can imagine probably sell out sooner than later across like stores around the world, <laughs> I guess. Uh, so let me know your thoughts down below. Have you bought this just for the Charizard promo? It's a guaranteed shiny Charizard, which is amazing. But yeah, check out my uh, streams. Every Sunday we do a YouTube stream. And yeah, you can get these for retail or under on our store. So check it out, guys. Make sure to like, subscribe. See you next time. Peace.